So episode 12 of the Football Manager Career Mode, and we're taking on Motherwell. 16th of October, we'll get Dundee United, Livingston, Freiburg, Aberdeen, with four home games in a row after this tough game at Fir Park. We currently sit seven points behind Celtic. This is the game in hand, though. Well, I believe it's the game in hand. It wouldn't surprise me if Celtic are still playing in this. But Haji has begun his rehabilitation phase, so hopefully we can get him back and firing, man, because Haji, what a man. But St Mirren take on Kelly. It's a 1 1 draw. Livingston currently sitting third, and we need to win. Motherwell sit last in the table. There's no real reason why we can't get the job done now. Gary Cahill has picked up a pulled groin injury. He's out for six to eight days. And we're hope but see, so I, I, they've just constantly got this game in hand over us, man, which I hate. They beat Hibs 3 now, which leaves us with the hard work of beating one win out of what? How many games have we even played there? Motherwell have played 10. They've won one game out of 10. We have to win. If we don't beat Motherwell here, it's just not good enough. Half fast, so fucking cr Oh, it's Tillman! And Malik Tillman has pickpocketed Motherwell, and it's an absolute disaster there for Motherwell, but we don't care. It's 1 0. Within the five minute barrier, boom, 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 I want you in my room, Tavernier, I mean that is awful for Lamy, man, Lamy, Lamy, it was fucking very Lamy. Takala whips a ball into the back post, Cholak, nowhere near it, Matondo gets it, Tillman flicks it to Sakala, it's back to him, it's Lundstrom, Big John, come on John, Goldson to Jack, it's through to Sakala, lovely finish into the bottom right hand corner and it's too easy, Rangers on top, Motherwell, greeting, absolute Pish for Motherwell. O'Donnell. Stevie O'Donnell finds more. Oh, man. Do not know how that was. Man. That was a belter of a delivery, though, for yeah, Stevie O'Donnell. And it should be 2 1 on the brink of half time, but it's misses like that that costs you points. And when you're in a relegation scrap, they really needed it. And it's Louis. Mo oh, he rattles it off the crossbar. McKinstry. Whips it back in to try and find... Oh, Aaron's man, Slater, he had Motherwell pumping us here. It's Sean Goss, but he finds Barris, it's Jack then. Jesus, good God. What was that all about, man? I do not know how that didn't end up in the back of the net. Holy moly. That was near good night. Near good night, Irene. As uh, Goss steps over this free kick, whipped in, and it's headed in by Tayo Adaramola. It's just a bit pish for Rangers, I mean, for being in complete control to... The arse collapse. Donald trying to play a wonderful ball here. But he doesn't. He finds Yilmaz. He's on for Tav. And Yilmaz now finds Tillman Lundstrom to Yilmaz again. Yilmaz leading a charge. Hopefully to make it 3-1. He finds Rabi Matondo. Rabi Matondo drills it in. It's Alfredo Morelos. It's 3-1. And that's where it's finished. Full time. 3-1. Morelos. Well, I mean, what a game. What a bloody game it was. Morelos, Sakala, Tillman with the goals. We've destroyed Motherwell. Next up, Dundee United. What a game. Can't wait. Into the next game, though, against Dundee United. We've put Morelos in the starting team because I think Cholak was just a wee bit shite in that game, if I must say myself. But there we go. We like all the player faces, man. Previous years with a hee haw. So we like to see here on the channel player faces. Waiting for the next highlight. Come on. Let's have a party. Let's have a party. Let's have a party. Borna Barisic. Matondo finds Barisic again though. Barisic. A crop. Wait, what? I don't know if Morelos actually got a shot away there or what, but if he did, how have you missed, son? Sakala. Outside the boot finish. Feel like fucking the box, man. Outside the what was that? Outside the box. Outside the box. Outside the boot. Good night. Lovely jubbly. Jack flips over a top to Alfredo. Beats Bereggi, but oh, he doesn't beat him. McGrew manages to comfortably get it. Goldson wins it, but 25 minutes in should be 2 0. Alfredo Morelos over the top. Couldn't quite finish his dinner. That would be once in a lifetime there. But it's in for Malik Tillman. What a goal. Bona Barisic. What a delivery. What a man. 2-0. Rondo. Solo run. Jesus. What a save by the goalie, man. Holy moly, whack-a-moly. Barisic looking for another assist here as he goes to whip this ball in. He whips it in. McGrew gets his heat to it. It's Matondo. Back to Barisic. Barisic in the box and the, the game decides... No, no highlight for that, Chief. Barisic, no delivery. Morelos can't quite get to Jack Lundstrom. Brought down, it's a penalty. 
who's going to be taking it? I think it'll probably just be Tavernier. We didn't even get the option to change that. So Tavernier steps up. He's on a booking. And it's into the back of the net. 3-0. The Rangers are coming. At 6-0 in the end, Tillman, Morelos, Goldson getting some second half goals in there, so that massively improves the goal difference. We now have within four points of Celtic, but when do they play is the question, because it's probably going to be a game in hand. Well, hopefully, I doubt they're playing Thursday. Rangers record biggest ever win. Um, I guess that's just including what i done this season. So our, big, our biggest ever win this season was 4-1 away to Freiburg, which is a bit of surprising, but get Levy up next. Game's coming thick and fast for this World Cup break at home. Hopefully, hopefully we can... I mean, it'd be great to be leading the league by the time we get into the World Cup break. But you know what? We've closed it to four points after being, what, I think it was like 11 at some point. The final game, though, of the episode, we're taking on Livingston. We've got Goncalves up front, Nubile out in the wing. Jason Holt, what a team. What a team. There you go, there is the gap. Celtic away to Hearts at Tyne Castle. So hopefully Hearts can do a job. Hearts sit, what, sixth? Not too much faith in them, but we need them. We need them. We need them. But we've got a good team, man. We're on change for the last game, so 6-0. I'd take, I'd take half of it. As Barisic throws it to Jack. Jackie by Barisic trying to use his left foot. Has to, I mean, he did that much effort to get it on to his left, just to give it away as soon as it went on to his left. As Morelos is almost wiped out by Georgie. New Georgie boy in nets. Tavernier finds Fashion Sakala, he puts it away into that bottle, oh for fuck's sake, disallowed, what? Is it? Where's the lines? Those lines are bullshit, they've made those lines up. There's free kick for Livingston, Pittman steps over it, what's the goalie day? I, this is in, this is in, you just fucking knew it was in! What's Pittman fucking doing man? What, when he stuck it in, like what's the goalie doing? Closing the gap to Celtic just to get a job out. I mean, look, you just knew. Like, what's it? He's not one near it. Jack finds Kamara, finds Tillman. Come on, Sakala, son. Whips it across, puts it right off Pet and Rice, man. Davies wins That's a good hazard to win. Out to us. Morelos, what a save for George, but the flag is up anyway. I, I, I thought that, but... We George, man. Holt whips it in to make it 2-0 Levy. And the fucking half, man. Oh my god, Jack Fitzwater, Fitzwater, what a pish name, Fitzwater, wait a second. Oh, we need three goals, you can do math, that's a goal every five minutes, you can't fuck off back to DJ, because George boots it up, we've created hee-haw, no shots on target, I mean, I don't know what we're expecting, I mean, how do you go for one 6-0 to this? I mean, and I can see Hearts taking points off Celtic, but Morelos, can we take points off Livy? He just launches that in, so hopeful and shite, and it goes back to George. George the wanker. Not the jungle, the wanker. On our kick, Barisic. It's, it's so shit, it's so bad. King finds Davies to Yilmaz. Yilmaz to Davies, launches it in. Alfredo, George, Morel. Let's see if that's offside. That'll be the third this will go this game. <laughs> it's been ruled out. Fuck off, man. That's not even funny. Three fucking disallowed goals. Aye, where's VAR when you fucking need? I mean, what? I mean, George has hit it. It's not offside. Not offside. I mean, for fuck's sake, Andrew Shinney has made it three 0 for Livingston at Ibrox. What am I even witnessing, man? What is this? What even is this, man? I don't get it. Fucking hell. Nubile, and he just, he, I mean, he, it couldn't be any more place. The technique for a jobber called Shinny is, is too good to be true, man. As Rangers are, oh, I bet you this is in. This is in. Or they're going to rule it out because he's something wrong with him. Oh, this doesn't even go in. Brilliant. Good night, guys. I'll do it for episode 12. Beat 3 0 by Levy. I personally, I don't really care what Celtic's scoreline against Hearts is because this has been an, a fucking absolute shit show. As George boots up, he gets the last laugh. Probably the greatest goalie performance you'll ever see in Football Manager is Livingston of Beat Rangers 3-0 at Ibrox. An absolute disgrace of a game, but they were good, like, it's not even like we were, well, we were pish, but they were good. I mean, that is, I'm embarrassed by that performance, it was absolutely shameful.
I agree with the manager. Well, I am the manager, but that's what I said. I'll let them know. It's Celtic beat Hearts 2-0 to extend the gap back to 7 points. Wah, wah, wah. Till next time, good night. Time to get a wee bowl of Cocoa Pops, man. Peace.